Creating starter strips from three tab shingles has always been a time consuming and messy process that can result in jagged and unsightly eave edges. GAF Elk, North America's largest roofing manufacturer, has eliminated the hassle and waste of cutting starter shingles with its Pro Start and Weather Blocker pre cut starter strips. Pro Start and Weather Blocker starter strips are manufactured with a perforated line that eliminates the need to manually cut and clean up shingle tabs, saving a considerable amount of time and money. Along with convenience and savings, Pro Start and Weather Blocker starter strips help achieve maximum protection against wind blow-offs by utilizing advanced DuraGrip adhesive. The superior quality that DuraGrip adhesive offers over conventional starter shingles is the reason GAF starter strips are required on all Golden Pledge warranty installations, the industry's best shingle warranty. Before installation, apply the appropriate deck armor or shingle mate underlayment, drip edge, and storm guard or weather watch leak barrier. When installing Pro Start and Weather Blocker starter strips in a left to right direction, the overlaying shingles must be applied in the same manner. The same principles apply when installing in a right to left pattern. For shingles with exposure less than six inches, split sheets of Pro Start or Weather Blocker starter strips can be used. For such applications, begin by separating the strip at the perforated line. When applying shingles with exposures greater than six inches, such as the Camelot collection, only full unsplit weather blocker starter strips can be used. Place the appropriate sized starter strip with the sealant facing up at the eave edge. For proper water drainage, both Pro Start and weather blocker starter strips require a one quarter to three quarter inch overhang at all eave and rake edges. Every starter strip requires a minimum of four nails driven in a linear line one and a half to three inches above the bottom edge. Begin with the first nail at a distance of one and a half to three inches from the beginning side edge. Space the remaining three nails 10 to 12 inches from the previous nail and the fourth nail one to two inches from the ending edge. When installing metric dimension shingles, you must trim five inches off the first weather blocker starter strip or three inches off the first Pro Start starter strip. This critical step ensures that the starter strip butt joints and overlapping shingle butt joints are offset by a minimum of four inches. Depending on the length of the shingle being installed, a 10 to 12 inch section of starter strip may periodically need to be cut and installed to meet the required four inch offset. Fasten the adjusted starter strip with two nails, one to two inches from each side end. For maximum wind resistance, starter strips should be installed along all rake edges. Begin by laying the strip with the sealant side up, closest to the rake edge. Position the starter strip so that it overlaps the eave starter strip by at least three inches. As with the eave edges, the starter strip must overhang the rake edge one quarter to three quarters of an inch. Begin the line of nail fasteners one to two inches from the side edge of the starter strip and one and one half to three inches from the rake edge. Complete the rake edge starter course by nailing along a vertical line every 10 to 12 inches up the rake until reaching the ridge. To learn more about GAF Elk Starter Strips and the company's full line of products, visit us on the web at www.gaf.com.